here we have a 2005 Volkswagen Passat 2 litre S estate. The last lady owner has owned it for eight years. I sold it to her eight years ago. Uh, a family's grown a bit now and I've just sold her a seven seater Toyota Verso. So time has come. It's a typical London car, battered and bruised here and there. I'll show you all the main things, but mechanically it is 100%. I drove the car 230 miles back from the centre of London to my house in Lancashire at motorway speed. Absolutely perfect. So there's plenty of use left in this if you're not bothered about cosmetics. Uh, we've got, we've lost, or she has lost rather, the locking wheel cap. So that's why the, the RAC had to come out and they've got a, a universal key. There's an alloy wheel in the boot, which in fact, why don't we show you right now? So all it wants doing is going to Halfords. I don't know why they have locking wheel nuts anymore anyway, because Halfords and any local garage have universals ones anyway. They'll take that out, put you put that tire on the one that's got the puncher, and you've got four alloy wheels. For some reason that cracked off. They had that off when the thing drove past and snapped it off, so someone's put it on temporary and uh, sprayed it matte black. Not the prettiest job, but it does the job. Uh, right, okay, let's come down. A few little fingerprint marks. Not the best, not the worst. Scuff here. Front passenger side. Oh, don't just rub out with a bit of tea cut those marks. Bit of a scuff here again. Bit of a tea cut and a bit of blue polish that'll come out. Just gone through the paint there, so a little bit of touching in there. I think the worst is it's been reversed. They come back to it and someone had reversed into it, so some van or whatever had reversed and put a ding in there. She's just spent £450 on a new MOT in September. It had two new headlamps, so the front bumper had to come off. They were discoloured, so the front bumper had to come off and had to have two new headlamps. It's only done 89,000 miles, this car. I think I supplied it to her when it had done about, ooh, about 30,000 miles approximately, and she's done 50,000 miles in five years. Typical London car, doesn't get used much. We've got one key. That works, unlocks. Now I will have to say the central locking works perfectly by the rear passenger door. For some reason, two weeks ago, the rear passenger door is jammed closed. And we're not quite sure why. Perhaps the kid has got a sweet or a sticker inside. But we've tried pulling the latch here and pulling here, but we can't, so some clever. Ah, now I can see something there. I wonder whether one of these dreaded loom bands has uh, got inside. Maybe that's the problem. Anyway, that wants lifting off and a clever locksmith or whatever will let that in. Or you can just leave it as it is. Boot's quite serviceable. Underneath you've got the spare wheel as I've showed you once. You've got the tool. Uh, you've got the cover there. So you are buying a cheap car to run about. It's not spotless. It's been used as by a family of five for eight years. So it does need a wash and a shampoo if you're that bothered. Or fold the seats down and you've got a good work van. That's what I'd suggest you do. That's what I think it's worth buying as, as a work van. I drive much nicer than any van. Starts on the key. 
so it's got a full service history it's all stamped up that beeps please refuel it's fully stamped up to 63 or 68,000 miles and then there's some services from there it had a full clutch kit at 880 pounds at eight uh, to 69,000 miles so the dreaded clutch rattle you won't have that that's the most expensive part that goes on these cars all the electrics work now lo and behold look what somebody did last month they tried to pinch the radio now why would you try and pinch the original radio because they're so put in easily they never even got it out the radio still left there with a the front on but it has got I'll remove this it has got an ordinary lead there it's got standard ISO leads there there you go so you can put any second hand 10 pound ISO radio that you buy from eBay or go to a scrapyard you get a CD these plays with ISO connections on for 15 pound I can verify that the climate control works perfectly. As I drove it back from London, and the clutch obviously and gearbox is absolutely perfect. As I added a new full clutch, which is all documented in the service history here. So, just the two owners from you, the last lady, Miss Sarah Shannon, I sold it to her eight years ago. 2006 and the previous guy one previous owner Peter Forbe had he bought it new so we've got lots of past MOTs is that the that's the important MOT look at that September the 30th 2015 showing all the mileages and no advisories so we've got a full lot of there's a service carried out at 74,000 miles. We've got lots of service in here. It's a fortune on it. Typical London service. Just took it into the garage. And she's just instructed the garage to do whatever. They've done a bit too much if you ask me. But that's London garages for you. Oh, it's even had a cam belt. Cam belt kit. £675. Wow. In 2011, at 63,000 miles. So it's had a timing belt, it's had a full clutch, the servicing's being kept up, so mechanically it's lovely. Power steering. So if you're not bothered about cosmetics, you're going to buy yourself a nice car that'll last for a while. Volkswagen reliability. They've had it all that time and it's never let them down other than the regular servicing and they've just done the two common faults is they do suffer from a clutch rattle which they've had that done and it's not a fault as such they do recommend this camp belt to be done at 60,000 miles and they've duly had that done and carried out so there we have it a very nice serviceable car for somebody to use for years to come on sale at 99p with no reserve please don't ask a buy it now price because i don't know what it's worth you'll decide what it's worth it'll be worth something to somebody i suggest you get them back seats folded down and use it as a workhorse and use it as a van plenty of life left in it collection is from Lancashire L39, Ormskirk and Cash. Thank you for listening to this YouTube video.